folks, my name is Mark, and this is why I hate the world. And uh, this little, this is a little quick little video that I had to do because of the uh, earthquake in Japan. And um, unless you've been living under a rock, you know what's going on there. There's been a gigantic earthquake. It's 9.1, I think it was, or something like that. And um, you know, thousands upon thousands of people are dead. And uh, we got about six nuclear reactors, which three of which are um, on the verge of melting down um, and the, uh, the radioactive storage pools on the roofs there are uncovered and spewing um, radiation into the atmosphere as we speak which is like uh, quite possibly the worst natural disaster that's ever like hit mankind right now in Japan and people in the United States on YouTube and on various forums and things like that are blaming this on God if you believe that so there's there's some dumb shit idiotic idea out there right now that somehow this gigantic fucking earthquake that killed all these people and is quite possibly irradiated a very large section of that fucking country for years and years and years and years to come was somehow payback for uh, Pearl Harbor. And I just want to say to anyone who actually thinks that, fuck you, alright? How, what the fuck is the matter with you people? I, I don't understand. How the fuck does, it, Pearl Harbor? Are you fucking kidding me? Is that, do you people really fucking think that? You really think that God did this to these people? God decided, hey, 50 fucking years ago you bombed Pearl Harbor, so I'm gonna fucking, like, destroy your entire fucking country 50 years later when all the people that were involved are dead? Is it, are you people fucking serious? I mean, why exactly would God destroy it? But God caused a fucking... I, why would... Why... Alright, let's just imagine for half a second that the, the universe really is as fucking stupid as you people think it is, and... For some dumbass reason, a creator god who created the entire universe, which is trillions about trillions of light years across, decided to home in on one little tiny country, on one little star in the corner of the middle of nowhere. And why would God destroy Japan? What for shit that happened half a century ago? What what the fuck are you talking about? Why how is that how does that even make sense? I mean, that's Karma, does that does that really make sense to you dumb shits? I mean, there's there's comments that I see, and this was over Reddit. This was on Reddit the other day. There was a guy that posted a big picture, and he had like 50 or 60 different little comments, well, of people saying shit like, you know, that's karma for attacking fucking Pearl Harbor and blah, blah, blah. I mean, you know, first off, if you believe in karma, what about the fucking atomic bombs that were dropped on... Hiroshima and fucking Nagasaki. I mean, that wasn't enough to make up for Pearl Harbor. No. Uh, God has to intervene, huh? And destroy and kill fucking, you know, thousands of people and melt down fucking reactors. Is, does that really make sense to you, dumb... Uh, it, you know, I mean, all right, for why... Let's imagine that shit was true. Why would he wait 50 years? Okay. Why wouldn't he just do it immediately? Why wouldn't... You know, if, if, if God, if, if there really is a God, and God uses natural disasters to punish people, why does he wait half a century? Why doesn't the minute you do something, a crack just open to the fucking earth and then drop you into it and kill you? Why? How does that make any fucking sense? You know, like, I just don't understand. You know, and you remember the, the Haitian earthquake, right, about a year ago? And, uh... You know, and then we had people like Pat Robertson telling people that it was like because they were fucking in league with Satan, right? You know, and then and then I remember that last month there was an earthquake in New Zealand. Anybody remember that? I know that was like, you know, three weeks ago is ancient fucking history to you dumb shits. Just think really, really, really fucking hard, all right? There was an earthquake in a 6.3 in New Zealand, all right? And, so, you know, property damage and shit happened, all right? How come that wasn't the wrath of God? Huh? How come God wasn't punishing New Zealand, right? So, so basically, when you know a country filled with white people 
hits it gets hit with an earthquake it's an accident it's a you know natural disaster but when fucking black people or japanese people asians and shit get hit with an earthquake that's the wrath of god huh is that what you're fucking telling me you know what about the Christians that live in Japan, huh? Oh, there are no Christians? Yes, there are, all right? It's a very, it's not a very big mind, a big group of, there are fucking Christians that live in Japan. There's Christians that live in Haiti. There's Christians that live in fucking Afghanistan, for crying out loud. I mean, they're everywhere. So, what what is it? Is just like when there's an earthquake, it stops at the Christian's house and moves on? Or is that what happens, you know? Bullshit, all right? It just doesn't make any... <sighs> You know, speaking of Afghanistan, all right, let's say, you know, your dumb shit fucking, like we were saying, your dumb shit idea is true and, and natural disasters are solely reserved as a method that God uses to punish people. How come God hasn't used a fucking earthquake and killed Osama bin Laden? Huh? How come he hasn't done that? How come a meteor hasn't fallen out of the sky and just smote him with holy fucking ass-kicking wrath of the Lord? Why, why isn't that happening? How come he gets away year after year after year but a giant earthquake happens across the around the fucking globe and destroys Japan. Like, why? Because they have tentacle porn in Japan? Is that why? You know, because God doesn't like hentai and shit? It doesn't make any sense. You know, and I just don't understand how people can even conceive of this stupid bullshit, you know, and it's... I don't know. I mean, there's a guy... Speaking of, you know, the, the religious nuts are easy to pick on because they're fucking idiots, right? There's a guy that I saw that had a comment that said something to the effect of, and it was on a video that Barack Obama was expressing his condolences for the deaths people dead in Japan. You know, we're going to help you and all that shit, right? And a guy commented on this video and said, you know what you did, your controllers caused this, right? And basically what it was was that he thinks that this was caused by the New World Order with the HARP program, which is high-altitude radar wave machine. It, and it, the HARP, for people that don't know, is a group of, it's a an array of radar antennas in Alaska that they use, they make some experiments with, and the coast-to-coast -coast crowd has latched on to HARP. They think it's a weather control device, right? Which I'm not really sure what it really is, but it doesn't control the fucking weather, okay? Nobody can cause, you know, this, they, they thought that, you know, that the Haitian earthquake was caused by this and fucking, you know, Hurricane Katrina was caused with it. The United States government cannot control the weather, all right? They cannot make earthquakes. If they could, every fucking day would be sunny in the United States. There would be no drought, right? And, you know, why? All right, let's say that they could. Let's say that, you know, there's it because there is, you know, a, a 0.1% chance that maybe... You know, who knows? Maybe this shit's true. Okay, let's say it's true. Why would they... Why would they destroy Japan? Of all the fucking countries on Earth that you would want to send a catastrophic earthquake to, why Japan? Why not Afghanistan? Iran? Fucking North Korea? Why not, you know, Cuba, for crying out loud? Fucking anywhere but Japan. What the fuck are you people... Why would you destroy one of your allies, and not only one of your allies, one of your chief major trading pon like sponsors? Like, why? Because what? What? What fucking reason do you have? Uh, why? Their economy was too good? No, it wasn't. Okay, they weren't... Japan is, Japan is no threat to us whatsoever. In fact, a lot of our economies are intermixed. Okay, this is going to fuck us up as much as it fucks them up. You know why? Because... You know, look at our auto sector for crying out loud, all right? Look at, you know, fucking all of the shit that you buy that says made in Japan on it, all right? You dumb motherfuckers just don't... They, no one caught... I just... I, it's, it's frustrating. It just pisses me the fuck off to even, like, hear the shit, you know? And you know what it is? You know what it is, is that the, the, the fucking Christians and conservatives and the fucking NWO wackos and the people that believe these fantasies... You know, they need to have this this idea that someone is in charge. They can't handle the they can't handle the fact that the universe is a truly random place. Shit happens in the universe. Okay, things happen in the in just on a grand scale. You know, whole galaxies collide and destroy each other. All right, at any given time, a comet could hit the Earth, or an X-ray blast from a quasar could fucking 
destroy all life on Earth, and we wouldn't even know. You know, the, the the sun could explode, and we wouldn't know it for eight minutes, and then we'd all be dead, right? Shit like that can happen at any given time. Every time you go outside of your house, you're in risk of dying. Every day that you live, you can die. You can get hit by a car. A fucking tree could fall on you. You could catch the fucking flesh-eating virus, all right? It doesn't, you know, a meteor could fall and destroy your whole fucking building. A piece of space junk could fucking land on you. That actually happened. A guy got hit by a satellite, all right? Shit happens, okay? Earthquakes happen for no fucking reason. No one causes them, right? There is no fucking earthquake machine, right? If there is a god, he doesn't punish people with fucking earthquakes, okay? You dumb fucks need to get this through your head because every time you... Spew this shit, this, th these, these idiotic fucking paranoid fantasies. You make the rest of us look bad. All right, people in other countries see that shit and they go, you know what? Fuck America. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go there. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna travel there anymore. I'm not gonna go to Disneyland. I'm not gonna buy their American car. I'm not gonna watch their fucking movies. And you know what? Fuck them. And it's all, it's because of you fucking assholes. That's why. Okay, you dumb fuck, idiotic. Fucking Christians and NWO nuts and fucking conservative dumb shits that believe these idiotic conspiracy theories and fucking myths and shit are ruining it for the rest of us. All right, you really you want to be a patriot? You want to help your country? You want you know you want to help America succeed in the world? Shut the fuck up! All right, grown people are talking about important shit now. Fuck you! I hate you all.